Made in Hull season may have come to a close, but there's plenty more still to come in the rest of our City of Culture year. Here's the lowdown on the relaxed and accessible performances coming up for audiences with physical and learning disabilities during our Roots and Roots and Freedom seasons. As the Wars of the Roses blaze on, Shakespeare's Machiavellian villain Richard III launches his own battle for the British crown. As the murderous king seizes the throne, he discovers what a right royal mess he's in. Catch an accessible performance of this gripping production on the 20th of May at 2pm at Hull Truck Theatre. All We Ever Wanted Was Everything is a three-act anthem about a generation promised everything. Brought to you by Middle Child Theatre, and performed in the legendary Welly nightclub. Join them for a relaxed performance, particularly suitable for people with sensory or communication needs, on the 10th of June at 3pm at the Welly. The performance will feature live acoustic music from Emily Moulton, and will be performed at a reduced volume with the house lights raised. For a theatrical debut that's sure to leave your emotions on the ropes, look no further than Mighty Atoms, an unforgettable story that follows four women as they try to save the home of their weekly boxercise class from closure. There will be an accessible performance on the 17th of June at 2pm at Hull Truck Theatre. Marking a new chapter for Hull's festival scene, the Big Malarkey is the city's first children's literature festival, giving kids of all ages the chance to immerse themselves in a world of stories. Through books, poetry, music, song and dance, children will be able to create their own epic tale, with accessible activities running across both days. More details will be announced soon. The festival is on the 1st and 2nd of July in East Park. Learning disabilities often create barriers to mainstream events, so we want to tear them down. The big gig will be everything a festival should be. Fun, safe and jam-packed with class acts. Only this time it's been designed with audiences with learning disabilities in mind. The festival is on the 8th of July from 1pm to 7pm in Pearson Park. See one of Hull's most influential creatives, Philip Larkin, in a new light at Larkin New Eyes Each Year, a biographical exhibition unveiling a collection of the poet's unseen personal possessions, photographs and letters. There will be a relaxed viewing of the exhibition on the 19th of August at 10am in the Bryn Mawr Jones Library at the University of Hull. Also at the University, some of Britain's best-known cultural figures will be depicted as part of an exhibition of contemporary portraiture. The BP Portrait Award, the most prestigious portrait painting competition in the world, comes to hold during our Roots and Roots season. The exhibition represents the best in contemporary portraiture, with the winning submission commissioned by the National Portrait Gallery. For more information on any of these events, or to purchase tickets, head to our website at hull2017.co.uk, email us on access at hull2017.co.uk, or give us a call on 01482 302017. And don't forget, you can be part of the community helping to shape a programme of diversity and disability events by getting involved with Artlink Square Peg initiative. Voice your thoughts on the artistic and cultural experiences available in the city at regular disability arts network meetings or join one of the focus groups.
To find out more information about the Square Peg programme or to join a meeting, please email the Artlink team on squarepeg at artlink.uk.net or give them a call on 01482 345 104.